Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm so excited because Halloween is right around the corner and I wanted to share with you guys our Disney family Halloween costumes. I have a six year old and a 10 year old and I am shocked beyond belief that I didn't even have to work hard to convince my 10 year old to dress up with us. <laughs> I wasn't gonna fight it if she didn't want to match with us this year. That was perfectly fine with me. But I told her our plans and she was right away on board. So I'm taking advantage of it this year. So I just wanna jump in. I wanna show you guys our Disney family Halloween costumes this year. So we've matched one other year. I've only done this one time. This is not something that I do every year. And I'll include a quick little picture. We all dressed up as Wizard of Oz characters. So I was the Wicked Witch which was fitting. I'm sure my girl, I'm sure my girls thought that was fitting. My husband was the scarecrow. My youngest daughter Reese was Glinda the Good Witch and my oldest daughter Finley was Dorothy. So that was so much fun. And I thought, I hope we can do that again one day, one year. So this year I thought we could all be characters from Alice in Wonderland. And I'm so pleased how this has turned out. Now I will say today filming this, my costume is on its way. In fact, it should be here today or tomorrow but I don't have it to hold up for you guys to show in this video, so I'll just insert a clip. Um, but the rest of my family, I do have the Halloween costumes. And the second thing I wanna point out is on Halloween, I'm going to be doing a vlog about how we get ready for our Halloween night and us trick-or-treating and just having a lot of fun. So stay tuned for that. So the first costume is Reese, my youngest daughter. She's six and she's gonna be Alice. So I'm gonna try to hold these things up and show you a little bit, and then you'll get a really good look at them if you wanna watch that Halloween vlog later. But I got this dress, I searched everywhere for the best Alice dress that I could find, and I just didn't like a lot of them. And so I found this on Amazon and it was not very expensive. I will link all these down below. Um, I just thought it was so cute and I loved it. And I'm gonna put little tights and a black headband with a black ribbon for her. But this is the dress, I got her She's six, like I said, and she's pretty true to size. I have no idea what size this is, let's see. Okay, I don't see the size, but I'll try to link it below to what I picked for her. But this is the back, it's just got, it's got an apron attached to it, that's the back. This is the front, and I'll leave the link down below too for you. But I just loved the simplicity of that. Like I said, I'm gonna get her some white tights, I'm sure she has some, and just little black Mary Jane shoes, just like Alice, and the little black headband or ribbon with the the black bow. And I just think this she's gonna look so cute. She's got blonde hair and blue eyes, and I just think she'll be the perfect little Alice. So my oldest daughter is going to be the Queen of Hearts. She's 10, like I said, I got her a medium. Hopefully this will fit her, but this is the costume. I got this and my husband's costume off partycity.com. So that is her costume, and I'll probably put some cute little makeup on her, do the red lips and things like that. So, and I don't know if she has any red shoes. Um, I may just try to find her some little red sparkly shoes because they're usually pretty easy to find at Target this time of year, or just some black shoes. I'm sure she's got some little black slip-ons that she can wear. But this does come with the dress, the headband, and the little headband I think is so cute because it's got the little crown. So it's got the dress, the headband, and the footless tights. So it's just, just exactly what you need for this costume. And then my husband, again, I got this from Party City's website. He is going to be the Mad Hatter. This costume does not come with um, the wig, which I I may or may not get him. I'm gonna try on the hat because I know those wigs can be so annoying sometimes, so I'm not gonna make him go around all night long with that wig, but we'll see, because that does kind of make the costume. But um, I got him this. Now this costume comes, it does not come with those pants or the shirt. I'll tell you what it comes with. It comes with the hat, the jacket with, it comes with the hat and the jacket with the mock vest. So you really do have to kind of add some things to this costume. I'm gonna have him wear probably just some khaki pants and brown shoes to go with it. Um, and other than that, the only other thing I may buy is that, that wig, but I may not, we'll see. And then my costume, like I said, I don't have it to show you guys, but I'll show you pictures of all these two. Um, I am going to be the Cheshire Cat. So I found my costume on Disney's website, just the shopdisney.com or whatever their website is, I'll link it down below. I'm probably going to buy some 
like dark purple tights or leggings or something to go with that dress just in case it's cool outside and I've got some pink shoes to go with it just some pink flats that will match the pink stripes in that costume so my costume comes with the dress and the headband or the little ears that it's showing in the picture so I could not be more excited about this. I hope it turns out really, really cute. I cannot wait. I'm gonna get tons of pictures and I'm hoping that we can find some events to go to to all wear these costumes a couple times because <laughs> it's always fun to get to wear your costumes as much as possible. Again, I'm gonna do a, a vlog later, uh, probably a couple days after Halloween, it'll go live to show you guys how these costumes, how these costumes turn out and how much fun we had trick-or-treating. So you guys let me know what family costumes you guys have done or just what matching costumes. These are so much fun and the opportunities are endless. I hope my girls allow me to do this like even after they move out of the house. What do you think the chances are of that? I'm sure that they're pretty good, right? Right? Um, so anyways, but I am so excited. I can't wait to show you guys the vlog. I can't wait to do the vlog. So be on the watch out for that. And again, I'm going to link everything that I talked about down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe so you can continue seeing either more Disney tips if you're on my Disney channel watching this or more videos if you're on the Faith, Life, and Beauty channel. And if you're wondering what I'm talking about Disney and versus Faith, Life, and Beauty, I'm going to, I have two channels. If you're on the Disney channel, I have more, um, I'll link my other channel. If you're on my Faith, Life, and Beauty channel, I'll link my Disney tips video or not. I'll link my Disney tips channel down below. So come and check out and subscribe to both channels if you're interested in Disney or in mom tips and just all kinds of stuff over on my other channel. But thank you guys again so much for watching. You guys have a great rest of the day. Bye.